It's with three minutes before the, uh, we go to the opening bell. We've got uh, minor moves, down 30 on the Dow, up 17 on the Nasdaq. Keith Fitz with me this morning. Wait a minute, Keith. You expect Tesla to triple in price in the next three to five years? Triple? Make your case. I do. Call me crazy. I love an underdog. This reminds me of Apple in the early Steve Jobs days when he came back and it was on the brink of bankruptcy. The fact is the herd is usually wrong. We've got a redefinition of the manufacturing line. We've got AI. We've got the charging network, all of which are worth billions of dollars if he gets it right. The numbers are going to stink. It's going to take every bit of discipline, but I do like it. I'm trying to do the math here. Three times 176. Three times 324. About $600 a share. About that? I know it. Call me, like I said, call me crazy. I may be out on a field here, but you know what? I again, I I feel this one coming. Even worse, you're on videotape saying six hundred dollars a share. I there know. It can come right back at you, you know. Okay, uh, you're watching big tech's investments into artificial intelligence startups. What have you got for us? Well, here's the thing, right? If you look at Amazon and you look at Anthropic, right, that's the tip of the iceberg. And many people think they're going to go find small AI stuff right now. But the big companies are beating them to it. So the best small AI is never going public. So you really do want to stick to the big players. You like underdogs? Go with Apple. You like Microsoft? It's a de facto leader. You want to go with Anthropic? Get with, it. Get with Amazon. Get with Google. Those are places to be. Tell me about uh, Costco and Walmart. I know you like them both. I do. Costco has been the outperformer. Walmart has come on. They've had trouble bringing earnings onto the bottom line, but I think this could be the quarter where that begins to change. So I'm cautiously optimistic Walmart's, in fact, going to come up and play catch up, which is good. I never think of Costco or Walmart as benefiting from AI at all. Do you? Oh, absolutely, because inventory management is one of the single most complicated managerial tasks for any business, particularly when you're dealing with a business at scale. Those businesses have also got logistics, Stuart, so AI is going to help them deliver better, deliver faster, keep value, more accurately inventory their goods, and keep a handle on cost, all of which is important to consumers. I've got Costco at $731 a share. Where's it going? I think that one's actually going to split, but I could see 900 or 1,000 within that same sort of 36-month okay. time frame that I'm outlining for Tesla. And Walmart at 60. Where's it going? 85. Okay, we'll settle for that. Keith, you're all right. We'll see you again real soon. They're about to open the market. Someone's going to lean forward, press the button, and we will be in business on this April Fool's Day, sports fans. Don't forget that.